Why hello you amazing watchers and welcome back to another video. Another session with Charlie and his obsession with recording at the moment. <laughs> um, I've been pre-recording videos since on Monday. I absolutely had the craving for recording. So I just sat down and recorded a whole bunch of videos, same, the same shirt. And, and today I bring something that's pretty special to me. I did mention this in a past video. So this anime has the longest title out there. Ningen Fushin, I believe, is the short way to say it. But it's adventurers who don't believe in humanity will save the world. Or something between those lines. <laughs> I watched it when it aired. It's definitely a pretty interesting show. It had a nice, interesting gimmick. Uh, definitely enjoyed it. It wasn't one of my absolute favorites, but I would definitely sit down and watch it again with a friend or so. Um, but the ending song is definitely what caught me the most. When it started playing at the end of every episode, it definitely brought a smile to my face. It does one of the things that I love when endings do it, and I mentioned this in the, was it the Bondi ending for Spy Family? I think so. When they have the characters of the show playing some of the instruments going off to the song, especially when it's a good song. So today I'm here to react to the Never Fear ending for Ningen Fushin by Mao Abe, if I'm not mispronouncing that name, which I probably am butchering. <laughs> but yeah, Mao Abe. So without anything else to say, let's get into the reaction. Let me just pull it up. It's an amazing song. Definitely recommend everyone to go catch the full one. But the visuals for this one is definitely one of the eye catchers for it. Oh yeah, there we go. The art style for the ending is so silly. I think that's one of the things I like the most. The show is a little silly on itself. It's about a whole bunch of adventures that were betrayed one way or another by humanity. And even though uh, they're all in with their different troubles, they band together and form this team that fits really well together. They really care about each other. Ah, that sucks when it happens. A string breaking has happened to me once. I play the piano and the ukulele, and I have a pretty old ukulele now, and one day I just wanted to play, and one of the strings just snaps on me. I was like, oh no, what am I to do now? I didn't have anything to replace them at hand and couldn't play, and I just had the craving for it. Ah, it sucks. <laughs> <laughs> it's so silly. I know, sorry for singing, but I mean, it's such a nice, catchy song. Speaking of the ukulele. <laughs> I definitely saved this song very quickly. As soon as it started airing, it was definitely on my list already. It's such a catchy song. Awesome. Absolutely love that one. That, that's not the animation style. Uh, Geek Toys is the one who handled this show. Um, they've been doing recently the newest seasons for Day to Life. They did Liar Liar very recently. That's their style. And this was just for the ending. But even so, it's, I don't know, it's just soft, smooth. What they did with the cutouts <laughs> definitely brought a smile to my face. Proved that simple things can be enjoyed so much it doesn't have to be absolutely complicated to be great and this is a good example of that so yeah thank you very much for joining me for another adventure hope you stick around leave a like subscribe 
uh, join me on this journey. Any recommendations you would like to leave, leave them in the comments. I'll read them and be reacting to them. So thank you so very much. Charlie, signs off.